We're on a mission to open a brick and mortar retro video game store in 60 days. Day 13. This, this challenge is slowly turning into can we find a property or a competent real estate agent in 60 days. This is just starting to get ridiculous trying to find a property. So our offer was declined. They want us to sign for three years, not one. And that's just too much risk. It needs to be a one year with the possibility to extend. So my real estate agent and the leasing agent of the property are trying to figure out a way to make it work. Pretty much the only way to make it work with a three year term for me is that there's a cancellation clause in there where I can leave if I pay an additional month of rent or something. My real estate agent is gonna try and implement that in. I don't think they're gonna take it, but we're still gonna try. Now it's back to the drawing board. We gotta keep looking for new properties and Oh my God, this is just turning into a nightmare. There's a real possibility that we won't actually get this done in 60 days. Just warning you, but we are gonna give it our all in the 60 days and try and make it happen. We finished listing that bin of inventory. We picked up a new one. This one just says ran basement random games. Um, again, this is just a big mix of a bunch of different stuff. There's PS2, 360, PS3, all disc-based stuff in this one, but a lot of different stuff. Also, we picked up everything that sold and needs to be shipped out today. Here's everything that sold. This is kind of cool. It's a <laughs> throat communicator. It's a microphone, Gears of War 3 branded. And then for people who say that nobody buys VHSs, this one sold for a weirdly high amount. It's like 80 bucks or something. But yeah, let's pack this up and get it shipped out to our customers. All packed up and ready to go. And we're still playing the waiting game. The real estate agent was supposed to call us at eight o'clock this morning. It's now almost 11. He was supposed to give us some updates with some options on what we could do to try and secure this lease. In the meantime, let's ship these. We just got back from shipping. It's now almost two o'clock and we've heard nothing from our real estate agent. I actually can't even express how annoyed I am. Anyways, we're deciding to take matters into our own hands. So we're gonna start reaching out to leasing agents directly. Hopefully we can get a hold of some leasing agents and see some properties without having to go through an agent. We finally heard back from our real estate agent. It's 7.45 p.m. now, so only 12 hours late, but he had a decent excuse. Somebody broke into one of his Airbnb properties and he was dealing with that all day. Anyways, he said he's gonna work on getting a cancellation clause written up. I'm assuming I'm probably not gonna hear from him until Monday because real estate agents normally don't work on the weekend, so. There'll be an update on Monday. We also finished listing this box. This is actually stuff that's not included, but that's done. There's a lot of low end stuff that's gonna end up going in our bargain bins. That's pretty much it for today. Hopefully we get an update on Monday about if they were able to work something out in the lease. And we'll see if we're able to move forward on that property we looked at already, or if we're gonna have to keep looking for a new property. See you then.